So guys, I'm in Mama Calabar. How are you doing? I'm in Mama Calabar. So guys, this is the reason Actually, I understand why they say, uh, what did they say? They say, don't buy the block, leave the block. Because some people just... And then I came back to Anyway, they know what's inside their hearts. It's a cook you know? restaurant. Because and I have if it never happened to me, I wouldn't have actually understood the meaning I am in Mama Calabar. But guys, before my food comes, I have to charge When you become... When you do that thing that you're doing that you're good at, you become All right, successful. Yeah. Catch you on the next. You probably video. wanna leave, yeah, because a lot so of people guys, are I'm just not Mama gonna be Calabar. happy anymore. I'm in Mama yeah. Calabar. So it's like they Actually, saw you before when you were begging them for a little change here and there. And so they actually so see now that you're doing well, they don't like it. And then I That's came how many, how many yards have I walked? I've already seen two line bikes. And I have decided when I was doing this thing that I'm doing now, they were laughing at me. They were laughing at me. They were calling me cold girl. They were calling me all kinds of names. Mad Nigerian, this, this, and that. But now that things are the way they are because now some of them they can't stand it so what Calabar. they do now is they'll be parking Actually, lime bikes good. You've got yeah a they'll Mama be Calabar. keeping got they'll keep the lime bike for me so some I've of them will keep other bits and pieces for me and then i came guys back to i understand Mama that Calabar saying now it's a because as and much I as i like kilburn Obviously, I mean, Kilburn is there. It's an area. So many people live place. there, and you but can't, you know, you can't okay. judge people right, the so same, and you can't tar video. everybody with the same brush. So guys, but I'm in Mama my goodness, I'm in Mama that everything that Actually, people say, the ones that have been through it before, Calabar, it's all true. It's all true. Listen, you see the graffiti. I'm going to show you the graffiti where I live. When I actually moved. Into the place, same there was no graffiti. and I have decided but I ever want since, to get a family okay, today. there's another so line bike for Mama you. But See, guys, before bike. my food comes, I have to yeah. charge this phone. At the very yeah. height yeah. of it, at the very okay. height of it, right. when I actually felt like Catch I couldn't go out video. at all, there were just bikes so all over the place. You know. It's like I mean, they were Mama literally Calabar. collecting these bikes Actually, to come and Hendon park, is good. you know, to come and park them Calabar for me. Yeah, these fucking cowards, so I into most of them, quickly, they see me all the time, but they could never Mama ever say Calabar anything because to my obviously, see, How many is that? Restaurant. I've just counted three. That's the third one. Some of them, this is the most that they feel that they can do that will hurt me. Some of them, this is the most that they can do. They will come Catch and they will the go and video. borrow these bikes and they will come and park so them guys, around Mama where Calabar. I live. Okay, so here is the Mama wall. Calabar. Yeah. Actually, see this wall here? You, you see this area here? Calabar, they will park all kind of stuff so to come and keep it. They will pack all kinds of things to put here. You can see the graffiti already. And I have decided I want to get a better thing today. In the beginning, there was just one little one here. guys, before my food Each time you come, they will put more tags, more tags, more graffiti. You see this place here? You see, you on the next video. somebody has designed this for me. So guys, this I'm is what Mama they Calabar. do. And I say to myself, are these Calabar. people actually really that jobless? Actually, that they don't have you anything to do. Okay, you see? This is like hundreds and thousands of people. And then I came back to the Because obviously it's a restaurant. And I have decided I want to be the first one actually Hendon is good yeah. you've got a choice of Mama yeah. Calabar you've got a choice of 805 so I popped so, into 805 quickly that's just, and then that's I just came a back little to taste. Mama Calabar I mean, because obviously, obviously this is nothing the same this is nothing compared and I have decided to what I they have to be the I had some very very so nice shoes Mama that Calabar. I could have kept guys, for myself my food but because I'm so used to giving from. things away to charity you know when I no longer use them I I prepared some of my things I'm in Mama Calabar. Yeah, I put them in the. I'm in Mama Calabar. I put them in front of. Actually, as I'm 
working and got a choice of I'm going to show you guys the shop where I put those things. So I popped in. I came out later on in the day after him. This was this was last year. Somebody was standing here on the corner where this Chinese place is, and she was yeah, she was burning me up because that's what they used to do. Sometimes they can appear from anywhere. Sometimes they'll be in all of these angles. Yeah. The thing about gaslighting is they do it in such a way that you don't know it's them. But anyway, to key back to that story of me giving my clothes to charity, I saw the boots. When I came out later on that day, I saw my boots here. But the worst thing it was, it was one of each foot, you know, so it was odd pairs. What can you do with that? Yeah. So what can you do with that? You can't do anything guys, with that. They did it on purpose because they know that, obviously, I can't take the shoe back and nobody else can use it. You know when people are just like wicked, they're wicked in a clever way? You know? So... Actually, anyway, London is good. You've got a choice of. I'm just praying to God. I say, God, please remove me from so this place. Right? Please remove me. I love, to I love Kilburn, but obviously, 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 you cannot you force yourself to live in an area. And I have decided if it's I not working, it is not working. You know. But guys, before my food yeah. comes, I have to charge this You try. Yeah. You try your, your best. You try, you know, to do your bit. Catch you on the next video. If it's not working, you have to move. You're not going to kill yourself, are you? Just to live in one place. Actually, Hendon is good. You got a choice of Mama Calabar. You got a choice of 805. I don't like my video to be too long. So, for this particular clip, for my spotters, for the ones who say, okay, why did she do that post about those bikes? I just wanted to give you just a little taste. Just a little oh taste of what I, I normally see. Yeah, they don't even park those bikes anymore. Even as I'm walking and talking now, doing this video, it used to be like it used to be like chock a block on both sides. You know, because you know they definitely they just wanted me to see it. They wanted me to see it because obviously anyway, guys. And I have Let's decided I want to eat a feather fan today. Feel me. Mm -hmm. I am talking. But guys, before, before I bump into the to charge this phone. Mm -hmm. So, I will see you guys more. on the next okay. video. Okay. Right. Yeah. Catch you on the next it's, video. It, it, the way that people behave about this thing. Calabar. Somebody does something on social I mean, media, you don't like it. Actually, My own generation, I even find it hard to say, okay, it's a whole so generation because it's an individual food. thing. Somebody does something on social media, you don't like it. Okay, you cannot just carry on with your business. You can't carry on with your business. You have to take your tired leg to the person's house because you're an idiot. Yeah, because you're an idiot. You have to take your tired legs, your tired personality, your tired aura. You have to take it round to the person's house because you found out where the person lives. What if the person comes out of the house and slaps you or stabs you or beats you up? What would you do? Yeah, you think you're bad because you know the person's address. You went to the address to go and come. What is some of you, eh? The way that you play with your lives. The way that you play with your lives is ridiculous. It's a generational thing because right. back in my day when this whole thing started regardless of what anybody said to you you will not go to their house yeah you wouldn't go to their house yeah unless it was the kind of beef that requires you to go and it would definitely not be for anything online most of the people from my generation they will not seek you out because of something that you said online but times have changed now eh? because when people started appearing at my house i didn't even know Initially, that it was because of this whole online bullshit, and I just said to myself, "Wow, people really do have some front." Because when you leave in your house to go to another man's house, you don't know. You don't know what the person you're going to meet is dealing with. Hmm? You don't know what that they. You don't know what they can throw at you. You don't know what they could swerve at you. You really don't know because you don't know the kind of mood 
that you will meet the person in that day. I have told you my own. They say that a word is enough for the wise. Some of you will never learn. Some of you are the kind of people that will end up saying, oh, somebody I knew or somebody that was close to me, this is what happened to them. If you like, keep on going to people's house to look for trouble. Yeah? So I this up to you. In other news, to my Spartans, if you like my content, if you like my post, and I have decided I I'm done with TikTok now today. because me, so I, I cannot be begging, I cannot be begging them. I cannot be begging them. Why should you be begging them? You have an account with them. You know that you have an account with them. Why can't you access the account with them? Huh? That's why they shut them down in America because they are so. It's like they're a bit backward in coming forward, if you know what I mean. You know? There's so much stuff that is so iffy about that platform. And for sure, definitely the Chinese are definitely using them to spy on people without a doubt, without a shadow of a doubt. Yeah? But all of these people, they spy on us all of the time. Right. You think they're gonna come and tell us, oh, by the way, we've been spying on you. They're never ever gonna say it. Not in a million years. Even on pain of death, they will not tell it. Actually, Hendon is you got a choice of Mama It's raining on me. I need to put my hands in my pocket. So I pop you on the next video. Yeah, we make you And then I came back to Mama Calabar because obviously it's a good same restaurant. And I have decided I want to eat a pedophile. So, guys, this is the reason I understand why they say, What did they say? They say, Don't buy the block, leave the block. Because some people just, some people. Catch you on the next video. Anyway, they know what's inside their heart. guys, I'm in Mama Calabar. Because if it never happened to me, I wouldn't have actually understood. Actually, Hendon is good. You've got a choice of Mama Calabar and you've got a choice of when you become, when you do that thing that you're doing, that you're good at, you become something. And then I came back to Mama Calabar because obviously it's a lot of same restaurant. And I have decided I want to eat a bear fang with Mama Calabar. So it's like they saw you before when you were begging them. For a little change here and there, but until they actually see involved. now that okay. you're doing well, they don't like it. That's how many how many yards have I walked? See, I've guys, already I'm seen Mama two Calabar. line bikes. Yeah. I'm when Mama I was Calabar. doing this thing that I'm doing Actually, now, they were laughing at me. They were laughing at me. They were calling me cold girl. They were calling me all kinds of names. Mad Nigerian, this piece and that. But now that things are the way they are now, some of them they can't stand it. So what they do now is they'll be parking line bikes. Yeah, they'll be keeping they'll keep the lime bike for me some of them will keep other bits and pieces for me guys i understand that saying now because as much as i like kilburn obviously kilburn is there it's an area so many people live there and you can't you know you can't judge people the same and you can't tar everybody with the same brush but and My I have goodness, I want to eat a feather fan that today. Everything so that people Mama say, the guys, ones that have been through it before, it's all true. Food. It's all that true. Listen, like you see the graffiti? I'm going to show you the graffiti where I live. When I actually moved into this place, there was no graffiti. But ever since, Okay, there's Actually, another line bike for you. You've got a choice of Mama Calabar and you've got a one, choice yeah. of 805. At the very height so of it, at the very height of it, when I actually I felt like I couldn't Mama go Calabar out at all, because because they were just bikes all over the place. And I have you know, decided that it was I like they were literally family. collecting these bikes so to come and park, you know, to come and park them for me. Yeah. These fucking cowards, okay. most of them, right, they see me all the time, sure but the they could never video. ever say anything to my face. See, see how so many is that? Mama I've just counted three. Mama That's Mama a third one. Some of them, Actually, this is the is most that they feel that they can do that, that will hurt me. Eight or five. Yeah, so I some of them, this is the most that they can do. And then I came they will back come to and they will go and borrow these bikes and they will come and park the them around where I live. And I have decided okay, so I want to be a better fan today. Yeah. So I am in Mama see this wall here, well, guys, you see this area here, they will park all kinds of stuff to come and keep here. All right. Yeah. So they will pack all kinds of things video. to put here. You can see the graffiti. Oh, you guys, I'm in Mama You can Calabar. see the graffiti tag. I'm in Mama it keeps on growing. 
In the Actually, beginning, there was just one little one here. Choice of Mama but Kalamani each time you come, they'll put more tags, more tags, so more, tags, tags, more graffiti. You see this place here? Then I came back to you see, Mama Kalamani somebody has designed this for me. This is what they do. And I, have and I think to I myself, to are these people actually place. really that jobless? That they don't have anything to do? Okay, you see? This is like hundreds and thousands, okay? All right, then. And then, catch you on the they next tag, video. They've tagged the wall in here. Guys, I'm in Mama Calabar. I'm in Mama Calabar. Obviously, actually, Hendon is a choice of Mama Calabar. Because they don't have any got a choice of 805. So, I popped into 805 quickly. The last time, then I came back to Mama Calabar. Because, obviously, it's a good restaurant. And I have decided I want to be the better fan today. That's just that's Catch just a little taste. Video. I mean obviously this is but nothing I mean, Mama this Calabar. is nothing compared I mean, to what Mama they Calabar. did. I had some yeah, very very nice shoes that I could have kept for myself. Calabar. But because I'm so used to giving five. things away so to charity, you know, when and then I, came I no longer to use them, I, I prepared some of my things. Yeah, and I have decided I, put them I want the, to be the fan today. I put them in front so of Actually, Mama seeing Kalabar. as I'm walking well, guys, in this my food, I'm going to show you guys the shop food. where I put that food and those things. Food. I came out All later right. on in the day afternoon. The this, was, uh, this was last year. Mm -hmm. so Somebody was Mama standing Kalabar. here on the corner where this Chinese place is. And she was yeah, she was burning me up because that's what they used to do. Sometimes they can appear from anywhere. Sometimes they'll be in all of these angles. Mama Calabar, yeah. because obviously the thing about gaslighting is they do it in such a way that you don't know it's there. The but anyway, to yeah. key back to that story yeah. of me my giving my clothes to charity, I saw the boots. When I came out later on that day, I saw my boots here. Yeah. But the worst thing it was it was one of each foot. You know, so it was odd pairs. What can you do with that? Yeah. Actually, what can you do with that? You can't do anything with that. They did it on purpose because they know that obviously so I, I can't take the shoe back and nobody else can use it. You know when people are just like wicked, they're wicked in a clever way. And I have decided I want to eat a pedophile So Anyway. But guys, before my food I'm just praying to God. I say, God, please remove me from this place. Please. Remove me. I love you. I love Kilburn, but obviously... You so cannot guys, force I mean, yourself Kalaban, to live in an area. I mean, Mama if it's not Kalaban, working, it is not working. Hendon is you know, you got a choice of Mama Calabar. You got a choice of. You try, you try so your best. You try, quickly, you know, and then to do I your best. To but Mama Calabar, because if it's not working, it's a you have restaurant. to move. You're and not going to kill yourself, are you? Just to live in one place. I don't like I don't like my video to be too long. So for this particular clip for my spotters, for the ones who say, okay, why did she do that post about those bikes? I just wanted to give you just a little taste, just a little taste of what I normally see. Yeah, they don't even park those bikes anymore. Even as I'm walking and talking now, doing this video, it used to be like, it used guys, to be like chocolate okay, block on yeah, both sides, you know, because, you know, they definitely, they just wanted me to see it. They wanted me to see it. Anyway, guys, let me stop filming and talking before I come to see you. So, I will see you guys on the next video, okay? And then I came back to Mama Calabar because obviously... The way that people behave about this thing. And Somebody does something on social media, you don't today. like it. So I am in my Canada. own generation, well, my food comes, I, I even find it hard to say, okay, it's a whole ball. generation okay. because it's an right. individual thing. Somebody does something on social media, you don't like it. Okay, you cannot just carry on with your business. You can't carry on with your business. You have to take your tired leg to the person's house because you are an idiot. Yeah? 
because so you're an idiot you have to take your tired legs your tired personality your tired aura you have to take it round to the person's house because you found out where the person is what if the person comes out of the house and slaps you or stabs you or beats you up what would you do yeah you think you're bad because you know the person's address you went to their address to go and come what is some of you eh the way that you play with your lives the way that you play with your lives is ridiculous it's a generational thing because back in my day when this whole thing started regardless of what anybody said to you you will not go to their house yeah you wouldn't go to their house yeah unless it was the kind of beef that requires you to go and it would definitely not be for anything online most of the people from my generation they would not seek you out because of something that you said online but times are changed now uh, because when people started appearing at my house i didn't even know and then I came initially back, that it was because of this whole online bullshit and, and I just said to myself and I have wow people I really do have some today. front so because I mean, when you leave in your guys, house to go to another man's house you don't know you don't know what the person you're going to meet is dealing with you don't know what that they you don't know what they can throw at you you don't know what they could swerve at you you really don't know because you don't know the kind of mood that you will meet the person in that day I have told you you my own they say that a word so is I'm enough for the wise some of you will never learn some of you are the kind of people that will end up saying oh somebody I, I knew or somebody or that was close to me this is what happened to them if you like keep on going to people's house to look for trouble yeah it's up to you in other news to my spotters if you like my content if you like my posts I'm done with TikTok now because me, I cannot be begging, I cannot be begging them. I cannot be begging them. Why should you be begging them? You have an account with them. You know that you have an account with them. Why can't you access the account with them? Huh? That's why they shut them down in America because they are so. It's like they're a bit backward in coming forward, if you know what I mean. You know? All right, then. There's so much stuff Next that is so iffy video. about that platform. Yeah. So and for sure, definitely the Chinese I'm are definitely Manhattan using Manhattan. them to spy on people Actually, without a doubt. Without a shadow of a doubt. Yeah? All of these people, they spy on us all of the time. You think they're going to come and sell us? Oh, by the way, we've been spying on you. They never have a Not in a million years. Even on pain of death, they will not tell it. Anyway, guys, it's raining on me. I need to put my hands in my pocket. I'll see you on the next video. Yeah, we're making videos. We'll see you on the next video. So guys, this is the reason I understand why they say, uh, what do they say? They say don't buy the block, leave the block. Because some people just, some people, anyway, they know what's inside their heart. You know? And I have decided because that would never happen to me. I wouldn't have actually so understood the meaning of that. But guys, before my food comes, yeah. I have to charge this phone. When you that become, phone when you do that thing that you're okay. doing, that you're All good right, at, then. you become successful. Catch you on the next video. You probably want to so, leave, yeah. So guys, because a lot of people Kalaba. are just not going to be happy I'm anymore. I'm yeah. So it's like they saw you before when you were begging them for a little change here and there. Until they actually see now that you're doing well, they don't like And then I came back to That's how many how many yards have I walked? I've already seen two and I have decided I want to either. When I was doing this thing that I'm doing now, they were laughing at me. They were laughing at me. They were calling me cold girl. They were calling me all kinds of names. Mad Nigerian, this, this and that. But now that things are the way they are now some of them they can't stand it so what they do now is they'll be parking lime bikes yeah they'll be keeping they'll keep the lime bike for me some of them will keep other bits and pieces for me guys i understand that saying now because and i have as much as i like gilbert 
Obviously, Kilburn is there. It's an area. So many people live there, and you can't, you know, you can't judge people the same, and you can't tar everybody with the same brush. But my goodness, that. Everything Actually, that people good, say, the ones that have been through it before, it's all true. It's all true. So Listen, I popped into eight you see the graffiti? And then I'm, I'm going to show you the graffiti like where I live. Because when I actually moved into this place, there was and no I decided I want to eat but a ever bang since, today. Okay, so there's I another, mean, another mama line mama bike for you. Guys, before see my food comes, I have to charge this phone. About at the very height of it, at the very height of it, when I actually felt like I couldn't go out at all. There were just bikes all over the place. You know, it's like they were literally collecting these bikes to come and park, you know, to come and park them for me. Yeah, these fucking cowards, most of them, they see me all the time, but they could never ever say anything. How many is that? And I have just counted three. That's a third one. Some of them, this is the most that they feel that they can do, that will hurt me. Mm, yeah. Some of them, this is the most that they can do. They will come and they will go and borrow these bikes and they will come and park them around where I live. Okay, so here's the wall. Actually, yeah. Hendon is see good. this You've wall here. You see Mama this Kalabai. area here. You've got a they will pop all kind of stuff so I to come and keep in. Yeah. Yeah. Then I they will back pack all kinds of things to come back. You can see the graffiti the restaurant, you can and see I the have decided I want to eat a feather fan today. Growing. So in the beginning, there was just one little one My food comes. But each time you come, they'll put more tags, more tags, more graffiti. You see this place here? Catch you on the next video. Somebody has designed this for me. This is what they do. And I say to myself, are these people actually really that jobless? That they don't have anything to do? Okay, you see? See, this is like hundreds of thousands. So I popped into quickly. And then I came back to Of they tagged us, obviously. It's a cool same restaurant. And I have decided I want to eat a better fan today. Because they don't have this phone. Yeah. Okay. See this big right. here? Yeah. The last time I passed you on the next some video, some shit. Like actually, my master guys in my dark caliber. You don't have any mama caliber. Actually, Hendon is good. You've got a choice yeah. of Mama Calabar. You've got a choice of 8 to 5. So I popped into 8 to so 5 quickly. And then I came just, back that's to just a little Mama Calabar. I mean, obviously, obviously this, this is nothing. This is and is I nothing have decided I want to get a fellow fan did. today. I had so some I very, very Mama nice Calabar. shoes but that guys, I could have kept my for myself. But because I'm so used to giving things away to charity, you know, when I no longer use them, I I prepared so some of my things. Yeah, I put, the the, I put them in the. I put them in the. Actually, seeing as I'm walking and doing this video, I'm going to show you guys the, 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 the shop where I put. So those I things. Into eight to five I came out later on in the day afternoon. This was uh, this was last year. Somebody was standing and I have here on the I corner where today. this Chinese so place is, and she but was guys, before my food yeah, she was burning me up phone. because that's that what they used to do. Sometimes they can okay. appear from right, anywhere. Then. Sometimes they'll be in all of these angles. Yeah. The thing about gaslighting is they do it in such a way that you don't know it's them. But anyway, to key back to that story of me giving my clothes to charity, I saw the boots. When I came out later on that day, I saw my boots here. But the worst thing it was, it was one of each foot, you know, so it was odd pairs. What can you do with that? Yeah. What can you do with that? You can't do anything with that. They did it on purpose because they know that, obviously, I can't take the shoe back and nobody else can use it. You know when people are just like weak. They're wicked in a clever way, you know. So, actually, anyway, you've got a choice of Mama Calabar. I'm just praying to God. I say, God, please remove me from this place, please. And then I came remove me. I love, you. I love Kilburn, but obviously, you cannot force yourself to live in an area. If it's not working. It is not working. You know. Before my food comes, I have to charge this phone. You About try, you try your, your best, okay. you All try, right, to, you know, to do Catch your you bit, but 
if it's not working, so guys, I'm in you have to Calabar. move. You're not going to kill I'm yourself, are Calabar. you? Just to live in Actually, one place. Actually, London is good. You've got a choice anyway, of guys. Calabar. You've got a choice of 805. Yeah. I don't like, I don't like my video to be too long. And then I came so, back to Mama Calabar because of for this particular clip, and I have decided for I my spotters, for the ones who I mean, say, well, okay, guys, why did she do that post about those bikes? I just wanted to give you just a little okay. taste. All right, then. just a little of taste of what I normally see. Yeah, they okay. don't so even park I mean, those Mama bikes Calabar anymore. Calabar even as I'm walking and talking now, doing this video, actually, it used to be like it used to be like chock a block on both sides. You know, so because so you know they definitely they just wanted me to see it. Mama they wanted me to see it. It's a cool anyway, anyway, guys, and I have decided I want to be a stop today. Filming so in Mama and so well, guys, before my before I come in to study the video, yeah? back home so I will see you guys okay. on the next right. video. Okay, catch you on yeah. the next video. It's, it, it, the way you that guys, people I mean, behave Mama about Calabar. this thing. Somebody does I mean, something Mama on Calabar. social media, you don't like it. My own generation, I even find it hard to say, okay, it's a whole generation because it's an individual thing. Somebody does something on social media, you don't like it. Okay, you cannot just carry on with your business. You can't carry on with your business. You have to take your guide leg to the person's house because you're an idiot. Yeah? Because you're an idiot. You have to pick your tired legs, your tired personality, your tired aura. You have to take it round to the person's house because you found out where the person is. What if the person comes out of the house and slaps you or stabs you or beats you up? What would you do? Yeah, you think you're bad because you know the person's address. You went to the address to go and come. That is some of you, eh? The way that you play with your lives. The way that you play with your lives is ridiculous. It's a generational thing. Because back in my day, when this whole thing started, regardless of what anybody said to you, you would not go to their house. Yeah, You wouldn't go to their house. Yeah, Unless it was the kind of beef. So that I requires you to go and it would definitely you. not be and for anything online most of the people from my generation they, they, they would not okay. seek and you out because of something that you said time online time. but times have changed Mama now but guys, before eh? my food comes because back, when people started appearing at my house okay i didn't even know Initially, that it was because of this whole online oh, guys, bullshit, I mean, and I just said to myself, "Wow, I mean, people Calabar. really do have some front." Actually, because is, when you leave in your house to go to Calabar, another man's house, you don't know. So you don't I know what the person you're going to meet is dealing with. And then I came mm -hmm. back to you don't know Mama what that they you don't know what they can throw at you. You don't know what they could swerve at you. You really don't know because you don't know the kind of mood that you will meet the person in that day. I have told you my own. They say that a word is enough for the wise. Some of you will never learn. Some of you are the kind of people that will end up saying, Oh somebody I knew or somebody that was close to me, this is what happened to them if you like keep on going to people's house to look for trouble so i popped yeah? into 805 it's up to okay. you and then i came back in other to news Calabar, to my spotters if you like my content if you like my post I want to eat a i'm done with right tiktok now, now because me i cannot be begging i cannot be begging them I cannot be begging them. Why should you be begging them? You have an account with them. You know that you have an account with them. Why can't you access the account with them? Huh? That's why they shut them down in America. Because they are so... It's like they're a bit backward in coming forward. If you know what I mean. You know? There's so much stuff that is so Mama iffy Calabar about that platform. And for sure, and definitely the Chinese are definitely the using them to spy on people without a doubt. Guys, without a shadow of a doubt. Yeah? 
back phone and they find all of these people they spy on us all of the time you think they're gonna come and sell us oh by the way we've been spying on you they never have been asleep. not in a million years even on pain of death they will not tell you it's raining on me i need to put my hands in the i'll see you on the next video yeah and then i came back to mama because obviously it's a kubu restaurant and i have decided i want to be a telephone today so guys this is the reason i understand why they say uh, what do they say they say don't buy the block leave the block because some people just some people anyway they know what's inside their hearts because if it never happened to me i wouldn't